Hey guys, it's Missy with Junk To Be Loved and I am back. We are going to do a, a pop-up drop sale um, since it is Easter on Sunday and we have the kids this weekend. I will not be doing a live sale on Sunday. Um, I'll have one sometime later next week, but um, instead of Sunday sale, I'm going to do a drop sale tonight um, so it's going to be straight prices. I'm going to show you guys the item and, um, show you the card with the number and the price. So if you would like to buy that item, um, just in the comments below, type in the number, um, of the item that you would like to buy. And it's just as easy as that. I will be working on invoices, um, this weekend. I will include this sale with Sundays and um, Thursday sale. So the I'm going to end all, um, well, I wouldn't say bids, I guess, but I guess I'm going to end this, this sale at um, Sunday at 8 a.m. So after Sunday at 8 a.m., no longer will you be able to purchase because, well, I mean, you can, I guess, but I will be working on invoices um, for the items that are purchased um, on Sunday because it's supposed to be really crappy here. We're not going to be doing anything for Easter, unfortunately, so we're just going to hang out with the kiddos and I'm going to be working on invoices and stuff on Sunday, so... Okay, so we will go ahead and get started. Like I said, um, if you would like to um, buy the item that I show, just comment the number in the comments down below. Um, if you have not purchased from me before, please um, send me your information. My email is junktobeloved at gmail.com, all lowercase letters, um, no spaces. The link will also be in the description below as well. Um, in case you missed it, but it's junk to be loved at gmail.com. And if you have purchased from me before, then you don't need to worry about sending me your info again. But we will go ahead and get started with the first item. So the first item is going to be this awesome tooled leather wallet. Very, very nice design. It is vintage. Um, it is uh, what, what is that word I'm looking for? Tooled with somebody's name, I guess. Um, but the letters are VLW and someone had the great idea that it could just stand for vintage leather wallet. So there you go. That would be fun, but it's got a design on both sides. Really, really nice condition. I love the leather binding around the edge, the trimming of the wallet and it is in good shape. It does have a little bit of wear, but nothing, you know, too bad. On the inside, it just a little, it could use a little cleaning. But it is leather. Very, very nice. It has a lot of pockets. I don't know what that says. Something's in there. And then it also has the coin part purse. And it is double-sided, so it's got this one, and then you can open up this side, and it's got two slots in there. So that is awesome. Like I said, it's in really nice, decent condition, and the leather tool things are very nice. This is handcrafted by somebody, so it took somebody a lot of work to do that. And so for the vintage tooled leather wallet it is going to be $14 number one $14 number one look at that beautiful work it's just absolutely amazing and very very nice so $14 number one the second item is a torb so stinking cute it is a vintage, a plush raccoon. He's like a circus character, maybe. Um, it is the Superior Toys. And it is like the harder, the harder plush. And he has the little thing if you want to hang him up. Um, Superior Toy and Novelty Ink. Uh, shell made in Korea. Contents, all new material 
celluloid fiber synthetic foam pellets. So it is the hard one. But he's so cute. So stinking cute. No rips or tears on him. Maybe a little bit of dirt on his nose. But other than that, he's in really, really good shape. I think he's so cute and adorable. There's his vintage tag again. And he is going to be $8 number two. $8 number two for the Vintage Raccoon plush. So cute. I love his clothes. He looks so cute in anyone's collection. And he wants to find a new home. So $8 number two for the Raccoon plush. And then the next one is this Camel Koozie. Now, they no longer make cigarette advertisements anymore. Um, and this is vintage, probably from the 80s or 90. Oh, 1991. 1991. And I think it's a koozie, but I believe someone may have used it one time as an ashtray. Because if you can see on the inside, it kind of looks like it's got a couple little burnt spots on the inside. But not on the outside. He's in good condition. He would look good sitting on anybody's bar or vintage, you know, in any collection like that. And like I said, normal wear and tear, but nothing too bad. And he is going to be $6 number three. $6 number three for the Joe Camel Smooth Character Cigarette Advertising um, Koozie. He's got shades on. He's just a cool camel. <laughs> So six dollars number three and then the next item is a vintage topsy-turvy now what's really neat about this one is actually it's a three-way doll so I will show you first it's little red riding hood look at her face she's so stinking cute and adorable little red riding hood she got her braids Okay, so then if you flip her upside down on this side, it is the grandma. The little grandma with her bonnet. How cute and adorable. So you can put her dress all the way down. And she looks like that. And then if you flip her this way, it is the big bad wolf. It is the big bad wolf. So how stinking cute and adorable with, is that? So it's like a topsy-turvy little red riding hood. And she's just on the side, on one side. So she, her dress, if you fold it, it's poke, red polka dots. So cute. It looks like some of the lace has came undone from her, from her um, cape right there. And then, again, like I said, if you flip her this way, she is the grandma from Little Red Riding Hood. And then over here is the wolf. That is so much fun. I just think that's so cool and unique. And so for the Topsy Turvy doll, it's going to be $14 number four for the Little Red Riding Hood Topsy Turvy doll. We'll get the cute side. She is so cute. I love her little red bonnet. She is going to be $14 number four for the Little Red Riding Hood Topsy Turvy doll. $14 number four. Love her. <laughs> okay. Then the next item is this awesome, awesome blown glass ball. I love these things. I'm not for sure if it's an oil diffuser or what it is, but it is flat on that side. So you could, I don't know if it sits. No, it doesn't sit flat. So you could do with whatever you want with it. Look at the colors. It's beautiful blown glass. I love blown glass. I think it's so pretty and there's no chips or cracks. This is a pretty decent size ball. It's bigger. 
look at all those colors so pretty and for the glass ball it is going to be twelve dollars number five twelve dollars number five you can see the hole right there so i'm not for sure what it's meant to be but i love it okay then the next item is this awesome mud pie set it is so nice so so nice It is like cast iron around here. And then I believe it's like a pottery. There is the label. It is mud pie. More contemporary or modern. But I really, really like it. And I like the design. There's no chips or cracks. These are very like solid pieces. So you're going to get the little platter and the bowl, the set, mud pie, love it. And so for the set, it is going to be $12, number six, $12, number six for the pair of mud pie. They're decent weight too. They have a nice weight to them. And then the next item is this, which I should have probably did a little bit of research, but that's okay. Um, I can still probably do, well, I don't know because it's so hard to read the name. It's signed by the artist and, and then it's dated 1994. It might be somebody famous. It looks like it could be somebody really good. But it's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful textured, like a pitcher vase, pottery vase. It's even got, if you can see it, like triangle design. Look at the design in the pottery. It is so nice. Such a really, really nice piece. No chips or cracks. Perfect condition. Beautiful, beautiful piece. And so for the signed pottery vase, it is going to be $12, number seven. $12, number seven. And I will show you the bottom again. Make sure I have it the right way. $12, number seven for the signed pottery vase. And then the next item is so cool too. It is a little brass um, trinket cricket box. These are little cricket boxes. I guess back in the day, people kept crickets as little pets, I guess. <laughs> you could use it as a jewelry box, a little trinket box, whatever. I love the little nubby feet. It has all four feet. And then you can open it up. And there's the inside. How adorable. Oops. Didn't get shut all the way. There we go. Cute little brass cricket. Oops, I still didn't get it shut all the way. <laughs> There we go. Cute little brass cricket, um, cricket box. And this is going to be $12, number eight. $12, number eight. Look at the design in there. These cricket boxes are so much fun. So $12, number eight for the brass cricket box. And then. The next item I have up available for sale is this beautiful silhouette picture. These are a lot of fun. These look really good on gallery walls. Um, and it's a cute little size. I forgot my tape measure. I would say it's probably like a six by eight maybe or six by nine. Really, really, really nice condition. It's got the little kitty down there on the floor. 
playing with its ball of yarn and the lady's knitting, it looks like. And look at out the window in the background. So pretty. These are so much fun. And on the back it says, made by Newton Manufacturing Co. And it's, it's in nice shape. Just normal wear and tear, no cracks or chips in the glass. And so for the silhouette picture, it's going to be $14, number nine. $14, number nine. I love out the window. That is just so cool. Look at those vintage curtains. Oh my goodness. Love it. And then the next item I have for sale is this beautiful, beautiful carnival glass, like the oil slick um, uh, Fenton plate, Fenton glass plate. It is stamped Fenton and has its original Fenton sticker. And it is a Mother's Day plate from 1978. I love the oil slick look, the carnival glass. There's no chips or cracks. Beautiful, beautiful condition. And I love the design. I love the mama with the baby. And the oil slick. I love the oil slick carnival glass. And like I said, it is stamped on the glass and has its original Fenton sticker. So for the Fenton glass plate, the carnival glass plate, it's going to be $12, number 10. $12, number 10 for the Fenton glass plate. Like I said, no chips, no cracks, beautiful condition. And then the next item is this awesome foil Jesus picture. This is so kitschy and gaudy and totally my style. I absolutely love it. This would really fit in good with anybody's gallery wall. Look at all those colors on the foil. The foil art alone is really cool. And then it's all, all those colors. It's so nice. And then on the back, somebody had wrote, Merry Christmas, Grade 3, 2006, Cheyenne. <laughs> and it, you can hang it on the wall or sit it on a shelf, whichever you would prefer. But I absolutely love the foil art. And look at all those colors and the design. So much fun. Bring some color into your life with this one. And for the foil Jesus picture, it is going to be $15, number 11. $15, number 11. I love the foil art. Look at those colors. I just can't get over it. So much fun. Kind of looks like a stained glass window. And then the next item is this funky boho rug purse. This is so awesome. I love these. And it's really nice. It's a durable. You could fit a lot of stuff in here and heavy things and carrying it around. And it ain't going to rip because it's a rug. It's made out of a rug. Look, the inside's in really, really nice condition. It's a really nice purse. It's got the Velcro um, closey, closey on one side. It is not all the way, oh, yes it is. It just needs, it's just got fuzz in it. There we go. It has it on both sides. It, Velcro on both sides. And it's awesome. Look at how thick that handle is. Such a nice boho style purse or bag really really fun and this is going to be nine dollars number 12 nine dollars number 12 for the boho rug purse and then my next item is this beautiful mid-century 
a mirrored vanity tray. You don't have to use it for a vanity tray if you don't want to. You could stick little figurines all over it or I would love, I think it would look beautiful with perfume bottles, whatever you prefer. It does have the felt on the back, the brown felt and it's beautiful, no chips or cracks. I love the style of it. It's just simple and awesome. And it's not just square shape. It's a really, really nice mirrored tray. And for the mirrored tray, it's gonna be $12, number 13. $12, number 13. And then the next item is this awesome. I had such a hard time letting this go. It's so awesome. It's a banana boat gnome. Look at the look at the gnomies. Look at all the detail in their faces. And who doesn't love a good gnome, right? And when they're floating in a banana boat, come on. Absolutely amazing. And this is a Tom Clark from 1992. It is signed on the back in March 1992. Beautiful piece, no chips or cracks, nothing wrong with it. It does have a piece of um, black felt on the bottom to keep it from sliding around. And again, look at the detail in those faces. They're so cute and adorable. A little gnome couple floating happily in love in their banana boat. I love it. <laughs> so whimsical and unique, right? And it's going to be $18, number 14. $18, number 14. The banana boat's just very eclectic. And I love it. <laughs> $18, number 14. And then my last item I have available tonight for sale is this awesome, awesome, beautiful woven basket. It is absolutely stunning and amazing. Look at the design. It took somebody a long, long time to make these. I believe these are all made by hand and it is What's awesome about this one is it still has its original tags. Now I will read them to you. This is um, handmade. Okay, where where did it say that? Hold on. Made in handmade in Uganda, but it's a but group of ladies did this. N a w o u. Handmade extends economic empowerment opportunities to marginalized and vulnerable women in Uganda whose skillful hands put life and color into grass reeds. I, I don't know. And fiber to produce environmentally friendly, beautiful design baskets. So basically this is handmade in, for, by women in Uganda absolutely stunning and it on the, what's neat about this you guys is it does have its original price tag on it and it's 34 dollars, which they've only increased in value but for you guys i have a very good deal it is only going to be 28 dollars number 15 28 dollars number 15 this is a larger one this is the most the biggest one that I've ever had. And look at all those design. So whoever gets this is getting a great deal. So $28, number 15 for the large woven bowl. Just look at that work. It is stunning. $28, number 15. And that is my drop sale for you guys tonight. Again, if you are interested in anything I showed, comment the number down below in the comments. Whoever has the first comment that I see um, will win that item. 
and I will be working on invoices on Sunday. I might start them um, tomorrow night, but not completely finish them. So in case you want to buy something from this sale, but all um, bidding will end, not bidding because it's set prices, but you know what I mean. Um, I will be done accepting offers at 8 a.m., but unless the item didn't sell and then I could, you know, and then I can, um, if you want it, I can send you the invoice, but I'm just saying I'm going to work on the invoices on Sunday. So this will be included as well. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed it. I never really, I think I've done one drop sale before. Um, but I wanted to do some sort of sale since I wasn't going to be on, on Sunday since it is Easter. So happy Easter, everybody. I hope you enjoy your weekend and don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And until next time, keep smiling and happy picking. Bye guys.